Hi, you get. And yeah, it probably helps that uh, I announced ahead well enough. <laughs> okay, for some reason my phone is just going ape shit right now. I can't get it to. Why is it doing this? I can't. I can't get anything to load. I can't zoom in. I can't... <sighs> Whatever. It's gonna be one of those days. Just more tech problems. My fucking shitty phone's gonna piss out on me now. I'm gonna try restarting it. In the meantime, I just won't be able to read chat until it's up. However, with your current level of expression, you're able to talk to him. You feel your relationship with Ushima is going coming closer soon. Sure. Ah. Ushima sighs, but he looks a bit happy. Hey. So, what have you been doing after school? Uh, friends. Hanging out. She was scowling. How dare you have friends? You're supposed to be a loser like I was. <sighs> this is turning into an interrogation, isn't it? It's not as if we have much in common, except for the murders. <laughs> About me, you're interested in the strangest things. Shima shrugged. It seems I'm a simple country detective living with my daughter. There's something about that to interest the high school kid. There's nothing about that to interest. I can't speak at all. Interest my high school kid. But you know, it really is good to have you around the house. I didn't think Nanako would be so happy. Well, I'm already tired of hearing Big Bro this and Big Bro that. You're more like a very young brother to me than a son. <laughs> Stop that. You're sending chills down my spine. Tsushima's laughing cheerfully. Okay, my phone reset. Let's see if I can actually get Twitch to, like, function properly this time. So I can read chat. I think it's been a while since I laughed this much. You're able to talk, frankly, with Dojima. Okay, there we go. Now it seems to be working. I feel the relationship with Shima has grown deeper. Yeah, I can see the chat now. Hopefully it actually is working. <clears throat> Social Link reached level 2. Your power to create personas of Hierophant Arcana have grown. Alright, I have to finish processing the data from work. Don't hit the sack too late, you hear? Nine. I said goodnight to Jima and went to your room. Today is the first day of the school camp out. You should hurry to the meeting place. School camp at dusk. Oh god, it's her! <laughs> Ugh, picking up all that trash was murder on my back! I can't believe someone threw away an entire bike! Damn it, litterers should have to deal with their own garbage. Anyways, time for dinner! Man, I'm starving! Dude, the girls cook just for us! Not that I expect much out of Chie, but Yukiko's got the full tradition of the Amagi Inn behind her food. You know it's gonna be out of this world. Uh, 
Oh, I don't know what to say here. I'll be honest. Oh, no way. I'm not falling for that. You just want it all for yourself, huh? <laughs> I can't wait to dig in. <laughs> you know what? I don't even feel bad about it now. Should we taste this? Huh? Only if you do it first. Oh man, here it comes. Uh, sorry for the wait. Um, we put a lot of love into it. <laughs> oh no. Well, really? That's kind of cliched, but still awesome. Okay then. Chow time. <laughs> hey. Shit, shit, shit. That's not supposed to fucking ads. Joke ruined. Okay, hold on. Where does it hurt? What the hell is this? My what kind stomach of stomach uh, 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 supposed to be like really spicy or kind of mild. This just stinks. しっかりと自分の状態を相手に伝えましょう。I have a bad case of diarrhea. I have a bad case of diarrhea. I have a bad case of diarrhea. <laughs> Please tell me that came here in the stream. Well, it just didn't mix too well, but it does offer a wide variety of texture. It's nauseating! Come on, it's not that bad. That's just your opinion. I'm telling you as a friend, don't do it. I wouldn't even joke about trying that slop. You lack the courage to go through with it. Ah. Uh. She and Yukuko are staring at you. It doesn't look as though you'll be able to fake it. The second you put it in your mouth, you sense that something is wrong. You can tell after one bite that this isn't edible. There's no way you can swallow it. <laughs> oh, we're sorry. Sorry. What are we gonna do? Our group's the only one without food. I mean, if it was even slightly edible, that'd be one thing. But I'm not taking another bite of this mystery food X. Something smells good. Hanako. Oh, I don't have any choice. And besides, she owes me, considering what she did to my motorcycle. Hey, uh, Hanako. You wouldn't happen to have any extra curry left, huh? Come on, give us some! We're begging you! We're starving to death here! No way! I'm on a diet right now, so this is all that I made. It has to last me. <laughs> all that you made? It's like a bucket full. Oh, I wonder if there's any way we can get something delivered here. But our cell phones don't get service up here. And dinner time's almost over. 
All right, back to your tents. Men's tents are this way, and the girls' tents are that way. Come on, people, look alive! Youngsters like yourselves should hurry up and get to bed after they eat. It's now time for us teachers to have some boo. I mean, uh, off to bed! Lights out! You guys are gonna pay for this. <laughs> Night. Cyclopius his temp. Damn it. I'm so hungry. And how the hell did you end up here? My teach threatened to hold me back a year if I didn't show. And the first year's tent is all quiet, like someone died. Well, if you were in there with him, I'm not surprised. Is it just you two in this tent? The other guys called in sick. Smart move. So it's okay if I hang out here? Hey, you're a stand-up guy, senpai. Don't worry, I won't make any trouble for you. They won't catch me unless we raise a ruckus. All right, all right, you can sleep over there. Dude, there's a huge rock under there. How am I supposed to sleep? It hurt like hell. Pipe down! Didn't you say you weren't gonna make any noise? Yo, senpai, can't you go just a little further back? Nope, there's a slope just past here. I'd roll down the hill in my sleep. If you don't like it here, go back to the first year tent. Hey, wasn't your teacher some guy called King Moron? That guy stopped me outside earlier and he pissed me off so bad I was about to lose it. He was going on and on about when I was in middle school, when he doesn't know shit about any of that. Not only that, he was bullshitting about how I'll be expelled immediately if I cause trouble. That ain't funny, man. Yeah, that guy set a speed record for jumping to conclusions. Check this out, right? I heard it from a guy in my class. He said that asshole was talking shit about the two girls who died. King Moron was talking about Ms. Yamano and Saki-senpai? It was like, it's no surprise that people who are unfaithful or run away from home meet a bad end. I don't know, maybe he was exaggerating. Everyone seems to hate that son of a bitch Moraoka. Damn, I could just picture him saying that. He never shut up about me either when I moved here last year. Not that I remember anything he said. Even if it's only a little true, it still pisses me off. The dickhead's a damn teacher for God's sake. Now, nah, don't waste your energy getting pissed at that clown. Yeah, you got a point. Wait a sec. What are you eating? Animal cracker? What the? Those are mine! Damn it! I was so pumped about finding the penguin today. Penguin? The secret animal cracker! You were eating them and you didn't know that? Are you serious? Well, you should have said something. Oh well. Oh, this isn't gonna fill me up. Let's just go to sleep. That's all you gotta say for yourself after taking my snacks. <laughs> Kanji, <clears throat> don't you have more space on your side? And I can't sleep over there, or my back's gonna break. Oh, okay. Uh, hey. Yeah? Why'd you come to this tent? <laughs> I already told you. Jeez, wrong with you. This is as good a time as any, so I want you to be honest with us. Uh, okay. Are you really, you know? Am I really what? What I mean is, um, are we going to be safe alone with you? What? What, what, what the hell is that supposed to mean? I already told you guys, I'm not like that. Well, then why are you all hot and bothered about it? That's just more suspicious. Hell no! We settled this already, damn it. 
Right now, I'm... Well... How do I put it? Uh... Oh, God, don't trail off like that. You're freaking me out. I'm trying to tell you that I have no problem being around girls now. Can you prove it? <laughs> prove it? Because if you can't, we're going to be stuck here all night, half scared to death. <laughs> to hell with this. If that's what you really think of me, then I'm going to go hit the girls' tent right now. Uh, wait, well, that's a little extreme. You don't have to go that far. They'll expel you if they find you. Don't tell me you forgot. King Moron's got his eye on you. Yeah, like that stuff a man like me. The dude's seriously going for it. Hey, man, you gotta stop him. The expression has increased, but he's not listening. You think I'm gonna put up with this crap? I'll show you guys. To hell with King Moron. No one's stopping Kanji Tatsumi, damn it. Uh, hey, wait! What? I declare myself not responsible for anything that happens. Ooh! Uh, my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Now I get why we're the only three in here. I can't sleep. Maybe I should have. I don't know. I was worried about getting in some sort of trouble. I figured that maybe if I was able to convince him to chill out, that I could have gotten like some sort of something out of it. But my stats weren't good enough. Oh, I'm hungry too. I should have eaten a little more of that curry. It might have knocked us unconscious. Sheesh. We can't sleep. We can't walk around. I wonder what Teddy's doing right now. Being alone all day is pretty rough when you think about it. You know, a while ago he... <sighs> Where'd we go, though? I don't think climbing down the mountain is a good idea. Do you think she'd stop snoring if I covered her nose and mouth? Just put a pillow over her face and just push. No, 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 no! Yukiko, no! Oh, I can't take it anymore! <gasps> oh, who's there? I can call you can see sent. Hey! <clears throat> Are you guys still up? What are you doing here? This is the guy's side. Let us in. Don't be ridiculous. If King Moron finds out, we'll all be expelled. Go back to your tent. We can't. Are there any rotten apples out and about? Any indecent students out there? Holy shit, he turned into a Ren and Stimpy character. All right, hurry up and get in. So why are you two here? Well, it's Kanji-kun. He's out cold. I, I don't know what happened. He just came in and then, and then he, he fainted all of a sudden. That's all, right, Yukiko? Huh? Uh, yeah. So there was no way we could sleep with him lying there, and you know, if we woke him up, he might have made a fuss. That's why we left him there. What? That makes no sense. He busted into your tent, then suddenly fainted. Listen up! Being insolent and being indecent are very different things. It's him! He's right outside! Hey, turn the light off. Sounds like an old Stimpy. <laughs> you can see King Moron getting closer. Hey, are you two in there? Answer me! <laughs> huh? Ah, so you're in there. 
Is Hanamura already asleep? Yes, sir. Fast asleep, sir. Don't get cute, Hanamura. Shut up and go back to sleep. <sighs> Ugh. I think I had one too many. I'm so sleepy. He's causing more of a ruckus than anybody. <sighs> there goes a couple years off my lifespan. No joke! We were nearly expelled! Hey, this is you guys' fault! Wh wh what else are we supposed to do? Anyways, we can't leave now! We'll sneak out before the others wake up tomorrow! Is that good enough for you? What are you so pissed off for? You better not try any funny stuff while we're asleep. Is that clear? Hey, we didn't say you could... Damn it. You owe us for this. You set up a barricade and sent a tent using everyone's belongings. You spent the night cramped up in a tight space. <clears throat> the students were all dismissed in the morning. Looks like we're the only ones here. What's wrong? Got a stomach ache? No, it's just... I thought I got pissed and ran out of the tent last night. It's so weird. Was it a dream? When I woke up, I was in Yosuke Senpai's tent. It, it, it was a dream. Must have been a dream. Okay. All right, then. Let's get swimming. Are you seriously taking a swim? Then I'll pass. I'm still all stiff. Yeah, I bet. <coughs> what are you looking at us for? If you guys want to swim, go right ahead. You know, you two still owe us. Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa! We're not going in there. I mean, we do owe you, but... Oh, yeah! We don't have swimsuits with us. Man, of all the luck. Yeah, it really is unfortunate. <laughs> oh, I see how it is. We put up with your dinner, we save you from King Moron, and you won't even have some fun with us in the river. No, it's really too bad. It'd be no problem if I had just had a swimsuit. <laughs> Ta-da! I've got you covered. <laughs> They're Juness brand originals from our brand new line of swimwear that just came in for the summer. I had a clerk friend of mine choose them for me. Pretty swanky, huh? Dude, that's just wrong. <clears throat> Did you have those this whole time? Come on, let's all go swimming. What should we do, Yukiko? It'd be no problem if I just had a swimsuit. <laughs> no, we really were looking forward to dinner. <laughs> I wonder what would have happened if we didn't help you guys last night. We get it already. Jeez, you just never let things go. All right, that's more like it. Based Yosuke setting us up with the fan service. <laughs> Those two go to get changed. Come on, let's get in. Whoa, man. <sighs> Stop staring like that. Hey. with you all of a sudden <laughs> man this is going even better than i expected kind of makes up for having to eat that mystery food x last night and come on you guys got to admit i chose some good suits those girls might be childish on the inside but i bet they're gonna turn into some fine looking women before too long don't you think so You guys cross the line. <clears throat> Definitely. <laughs> ah, it's freezing. You, 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 
didn't have to push us in? Who cares? You were going in the river anyway. They brought this on themselves. Sheesh. Aren't they the worst, Kanji Kun? Hey, you've been awful quiet. Are you feeling okay? D don't tell me the injuries from yesterday are still. Uh. What? <laughs> oh, no. is vomiting further up there. Oh, God. So that's why no one else was here. Good thing we noticed before we went in. Senpai. Don't say it. You feel as though a million showers will never make you clean? <laughs> oh, God. school camp. It's awesome. Let's go camp. You should go back to your room and rest. Thought I'd check. You haven't brought up anything from Home Shopping Program this week. You should watch it. Okay, how much money do I even have? 52 grand. That's right. I did all that farming in the last stream. Okay, what do we got? Power belt. Comes with... Two herbal pills. Only 5k. Or I can buy a fish. <laughs> I think I'll take the belt. student of the second classroom building for me to talk to about kanji oh i'm guessing it's that blue haired one that he was chasing when i first encountered him sure there's some shops at that place. I don't think riding around the neighborhood would get me there, though. Would it? I, I want to check out that other town that I unlocked. Go directly there from the map. Okay. Oh, it just adds it. Okay, cool. Good, that probably means that it doesn't take out of my time then to go here. That's cool. Okay, so this is the movies. Shit, you don't 
need anything from the police? I'm just been stationed here, but it's great. It's my dream to be posted here. Sorry for blabbering. I need anything just to add that. Bookstore has a good number of books. Okay, instead of telling me about it. Maybe it's not open? Very different. Oh, I'm guessing this is where I can buy, like, costumes for the TV world. Tell me if he takes me. You ever caught my eye? I must say you're a rare bird. Your cool exterior doesn't completely hide your surging feelings. Shashin radars, ping, 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 comrade. Uh, just for you, I'll make an exception and personally coordinate some charismatic ensembles for you. I can introduce you to a new arrival. That's a swimsuit. It's one of which highest recommendations start your summer off right. Whoever wears these will scorch the summer sun. Green with envy. Also, this is part of a set can only be equipped by the specified person. It's that person unique look, so try buying them to see what it is. Yo? It's expensive though. Guys, we're gonna make some smart money decisions tonight. Oh, I, I meant to equip that. Hmm. Not enough left. I shouldn't spend it all in one place anyway. and they're kind of expensive too, but once you get them, you have them forever as far as I'm aware. I'm, I'm assuming because this is an RPG, this game probably is a new game plus, right? Look in your eyes. If you take coffee I make, your consciousness will be swallowed by the rapids. So every time you will simply run away. Not be denied, the opportunity must have resolve. If it does, cool. This is definitely a game I would play again. I wouldn't stream it again, but... Cafe and drink coffee. Spend time there. May be able to obtain something you never expected by drinking this brew. Try going inside when you have time. Okay. I get a... I'm gonna give up on that for now. It's probably just not open. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that doesn't take time out of my day to go in there. Uh, if you have a persona equipped with a skill card ability, you go to drink coffee there. They give you that card for a give you that card for that skill. So give it to any persona. Oh. That reminds me, at some point I need to do some reading on some skills. And I should, like, look into what I can do with the skill cards that I have. Maybe try to come up with something good. Uh, what am I doing? Shopping district. See if there's any equipment I can get. Speaking of. Oh, 
Okay. Enter blacksmith's store. Get quest to bring him fish. <laughs> Imagine if that's how that worked in real life. You just walk into the store to buy something and just like, hey, get me a fucking fish. Uh, expendables. No, wait, Expendables is the... These items right here are marked with the little gem. Those are all the sellables, right? There's like nothing else for these, if I recall. Yeah, I think so. Just get the shrine to remind yourself what side quest you have to do there for the fox since it's been a while. Not really worth it. Okay, so just sell them. Or not really worth selling them. Let me take a look at armor. You would just sell them? Okay. Yeah, that's a lot of gold. I'm basically making back everything that I spent at the clothes store. Okay. Yeah, I pretty much just made everything back. Should, uh, I'm gonna focus on armor and weapons. <laughs> A desk. That's a pretty decent boost. That's right, I got those special shoes off of the thing. That's not very good. Hmm. Yeah. Decent gear for free just from playing the game. Yeah. I figured I might as well. I don't think Chie has anything, does she? Charm robe. You know what, though? Uh, Chie, I'm actually not going to be using in my party anymore, so I probably shouldn't bother too much with that. At least not until the end. I'm going to stick with that. Look at that, that's a pretty significant boost. I should definitely do, at least do this one, because... I haven't gotten him anything yet. Oh, I spent a lot there, actually. <laughs> uh, It's good to get Kanji equipment anyways, because I want to start using him more. He's a good hard hitter. Okay. man who gave me that leaf. Now he lives at my grandson, thanks to you. 
Make the god of this shrine for bringing the two of us together. I want to start restoring the shrine, but it's just in such disrepair. I have to make it a much better shrine, but I don't have the money to do so or do any work on it. I've decided to sell matchmaking fortunes in the hopes of offsetting some of the costs involved. Usually I only set them on special occasions like New Year's, but this is for the good of the shrine. I got these matchmaking fortunes from a famous shrine, so they may work wonders. You should try it sometime. I'm sure it'll get you closer to the grow of your dreams. Oh, but I put the fortunes away on a rainy day, so watch out for that. Now I need to go see my grandson today. Bye now, my boy. And then leaves energetically. You can now draw fortunes. Draw a fortune and think about which link you wish to strengthen. You can deepen your relationship just a bit. And the time of the person will deepen the relationship more than a fortune. Use fortunes to improve relationships with people who are currently unavailable. Okay. This feature is something better saved for when you can go outside at night. Oh, eventually I'll be able to go out. Okay, that's nice to know. This is strange main building. What will you do? Accept the Emma's request. Be sure that there was no one around and called for the fox. <clears throat> the fox brought you an Emma with a wish written on it. This Emma is written in, a rounded in rounded characters. It's probably a young girl's handwriting. I want things to go well with the person I love. It seems the fox wants you to fulfill the wish written on the Emma on its behalf. You'll be thinking that if wish is fulfilled, more money will be put in the uh, offertory box. If you fulfill the wish of the Emma, your relationship with the fox will grow stronger. Accept the request. The fox seems happy. Okay, uh... What's his name now? Let's draw our fortunes out here. <laughs> One's here really work. I'm going to find out if I can marry him. He plans to go play soccer with my friends though. What? You wanna go play soccer? We're on a date, how rude. This is a date? Okay, so... that uh it's around here somewhere can i do this when it's not raining no no it has to be a rainy day Books or anything new here? Seems a new. Oh, look at that. For our macho. 1,200 yen. Excuse the praise of me. Well, we also got ghost stories. <laughs> Increases courage. Raise courage. Catch bugs. Something tells me the more valuable one will have a better boost. Okay, 
considering going into the TV for a little grinding. You know what just hit me? I just spent 24,000 gold on an outfit for a character that's not even going to be a regular part of my party anymore. Fuck. Worth it. Uh, let me think here. That's not what I meant to click. Pick up quests around the town. You know what? That's a good idea. Uh, are you interested in books? I ended up throwing my books away when I'm done with them. I feel bad for the books, though. I thought maybe someone like you could give them a little love. Are you interested? I'll just give you my books for free. You want a peach seed? I'm one of those and I'll trade you a book. Don't seem to have it. Okay, I don't have one. Fire on Acha. Man, it's powerful. Should go stories. I've just been hearing the kids this summer. I've been going to the hospital a lot recently to see my grandmother. Maybe I need those sto ghost stories. Haha. <laughs> the next shipment is going to be on June 28th. I hear it'll be a sequel to Holy Teacher. I'm so excited. Wait, can I talk to you? Are you free? It's nice of a young man like you to spend time with an old lady like me. Listen to what I have to say. Do you know what a wedding veil is? <clears throat> That's very admirable in someone as young as you. How's that? When a woman gets married, she wears a veil. It... Uh, I was told to prevent Stevens from making her grow horns after the wedding. Oh, this lady's crazy. My mother-in-law insisted that I wear one. It's outrageous that you'd even consider not wearing one, she said. She, uh, she always did what she wanted in life. I'm not joking. She really didn't like me, not at all. Anyway, I refused to wear a veil, and we ended up getting into a shouting match during the wedding ceremony. Before I knew it, here I am, just as old as she was, shouting and getting angry at everybody. But I'm starting to regret it. I'd say my horns finally fell off or something, wouldn't you? I thought I should hang some horns above my bed as a symbol of how I'm turning my outlook on life around. I tell visitors, oh yeah, those were the horns I grew after I got married. <laughs> but nobody sells them. Really? What a sh I, I, I know I'm taking this too serious here, but this whole conversation... That's so nice of you. I'm counting on you to find me some good ones now. Just an old, random old lady just grabs my arm in the street. Bring me horns! Uh, okay. Shopping district. Shima's sons, you have to hear me out. Cabbage, there's no cabbage. What are you going to do? My grandfather refused to eat anything that wasn't grown in Indi Inaba. You can. Well, that's wonderful. You can wear three cabbages. I'm so glad to have your help. Just screw it elsewhere. And... It's expensive. What should I do? Yo! Man, I got an offer I think you might be interested in. Since you have Jack Frost, the Persona Magician. Thing is, this would take time out of my day, and I wouldn't be able to. See you later. Some more quests you can get from the north side of town, as well as by the riverbank. You know what? There was somewhere on the other town too, Okina. I should scoop all those up real quick. I really should just start talking to people whenever I see the bubble. No reason not to. It kind of just solves itself, so. Uh, days I think, two, six. Six bonus days. The 30th is an extra special day. 
Price is now Jack Frost doll. Supplies limited. First come, first serve. Hey, you have a lot of time on your hands right now. A little trouble. I feel like making some money. Oh, really? Well, here you go. Shoved a bunch of pocket tissue packets into your arms. These have an ad on them. I want you to hand them out to people around town. Just anyone who looks like they're killing time. You don't have to give them to anyone. Looks like they're walking somewhere. There are costume shops and cafes on the other side of the station, so be sure to hit up the people there. Cover the area by the police station, too. I'm counting on you. Hand a package of paper to the police officer at the station. For me? I can't accept things from citizens, unless it's for the lost and found. Pack a tissue to the men on the opposite side of the 30 frame. What? Tissues? Oh great, these always come in handy. Yeah, like you're hung when you're hungry. I'm gonna eat the tissues, okay? You're not blowing your nose during the movie either. Me? Thank you. I'll make I'll make sure to carry these with me. Be useful for fucking my fingers from the movie concessions. So many uses for tissue paper, making voodoo dolls and stop just stop. Sorry about that. Hey, I'll take one too. What? I don't usually take these things. Well, if it's just tissue, sure. I'll take some since you're so cute. Mm, I don't have, I haven't got more fashionable clothes. And the man standing across from the uh, Croco fur. A pack of tissues. This thin, brittle tissue paper is just like my life. Thanks, I'll take some. The shop across the way has a wide variety of clothes, but it doesn't seem like I have that many options in life. A couple in front of the paper. It was in bad timing. Very smooth. It's fair that I hear you praise someone. Here, I'll take some. To commemorate the occasion. So, wanna go to that cafe and why not relax for a while? Finish handing out all the tissues. Riveting quest. <laughs> oh, you're done? Well, here you go. You saved me. Okay. Oh yeah, if you got any some time, you should give the craning game a try. Very human. It's absolutely hard when you're older. My daughter's family's getting nosy again, chattering on about how I shouldn't be pushing myself. They look at me with that apologetic faces and say things like, Isn't it inconvenient for you at your age? I know I don't have too many years left, but I don't want everybody's pity. Gee, such silly things to worry about. By the way, I have a small favor to ask you if it's alright. You, come across any many keys? be honest, I'd like you to search for one. An old key at that. Please, don't ask why I need it. It's just something I need to open. Ah, thanks. Oh yes, how about something you could never buy with money? R really? Well, I know you're not just gonna stumble on a key all of a sudden, but... Sorry, it bothers me. I can't help it. I'll leave it to you. Or an old key, like the regular keys I get for the chest? Hot and humid. Oh, it's. You need to put yourself out, really. Okay, this is like a specific key. Somewhere hot and humid. I think there's a sauna in this game, isn't there? But I have a fish hook. Right, right. Which is where I was gonna do my grinding. 
Hey you, are you from around here? Can I ask you something? You know about the Mori Romaru? Years ago, I was the manager of the Koichi Liquor Store right here in this town's very shopping district. I kind of lost the will to do business, and I quit my job as a manager. Anyway, to be honest, I shouldn't have come out here to the country, but I can't go back home empty-handed, you know? You're from around here, aren't you? You think you can find me a Mori Romaru? Uh, I was supposed to be managing the local product section in on store. store. I don't know much about the area, and I can't bear to go back in there, so could you go look for it for me. I'll even give you a fitting reward. How about it? Thank you. It's really at a loss as what to do. Definitely at Kishi Liquor Store. I don't think any other places I could get it. What is it? Romari... Can I even go there yet? That location doesn't sound familiar. Oh, okay, I can't go up those. The stair that staircase leading to nothing. It's the liquor store in the TV world. Oh, okay. I think that said quest number three, so I'm gonna assume that that's probably like one of the early ones. I just don't remember. I think I've about gotten everything. I got that one. Youngins probably don't even know us, but Tanaba used to be a very prosperous town back in the day. It was a coal mining town and everyone was tough. There were never any weird events you have nowadays. You could see the passion for life in everyone, everyone's eyes back then. It didn't show any sign of stopping. What will you do? <sighs> All this worrying about the town really tires me out. At times like this, a sauna would be nice. Yeah, saunas are great. It's no good if you can't get coal. The problem is you can't get my hands on any. I can't get my hands on any. Can people bring coal. The man begins looking around. For me. Oh. oh, there are a lot of worthless young punks out there, but you, boy, you're different. You're getting a reward when you can bring coal. Okay, now I should be ready to go. Let's go. I'm going to not I'm going to try not to spend too much time in here like I did last time. Wait a minute, the fox is here. All oh, right. Wait a minute, what Okay, for a second there I thought I was able to add them to my party. <laughs> There's no enemies, there's gonna knock out that quest immediately. You know what? Why don't I do that real quick then?
Might as well bring you. Found some unopened sick. Where are Maru? Oh, there's not like any sort of dungeon here. Okay, I'm gonna swap you back in. Okay, that's done. One of these has light. I think it's my, uh... Is it? Is it this is the hard part of this game for me. Like, here we go. It's, uh, it's this one. You get so many different ones with so many different attacks. This game would definitely benefit from uh, the little typing icons like Pokemon has. Faces, though. The only one actively using the Persona skills. Yeah, I get that, but I mean like when picking them. Immediately visible in the menus. That's great. I'll definitely have to check out 5 at some point. It'll be a long while before I do, though, because I'm, I'm sure it's probably just as long as this one was, and I've talked before about how long games are going to stress me out with streaming. Especially when I have the backlog that I do. I still need to do like the uh, Age of Calamity second DLC, for example. Three enemies, but they're too slow. Oh, well, wait a minute, there's another thing here. Oops. That was weak to it. That's one so far. Light will work. Yeah, they're weak to white. Same ballpark, yeah, I figured.
Oh, the fox. Chie, you're wearing the wrong thing. Soul food. Let me see one of your inactive party members standing around in a dungeon. Terrible. You can talk to them and get an item. Oh, really? I'll have to go back and do that then. Electricity will work on it. I feel like I used to get these a lot less often. I'm wondering what it is that actually triggers this. Chess key. Skill card or chess key? That's a tough one. Skill. Rank 2 sword card. I think I started to make a statement, but I got sidetracked. Uh, something this game would definitely benefit from is something like the Pokemon box in Pokemon, where if you have a full party, then it just goes to like a box in storage that you can take out of. Things are sharper than usual today. The search is going well, leader. Okay, you stay fired up too, bud. You wanna use this? I think it might be useful. Maybe. Chest key, nice. Uh, finishing the battle with an all out attack will always trigger shuffle time. Not sure if the mechanics otherwise. Maybe, um, maybe defeating them all in one turn. Might be it, because that seems to be what happens. As well. I smell three enemies. Don't get careless. Let's do this. Persona. It's not going down. Go for it. Here goes. Time. Oh, ready. Then again, I do get these a lot, too. I always go out of my way to use weaknesses. Good way to get loot, though. Crush recovery. Hard on hand becomes a persona. See if I can go the trip without accidentally triggering the SOS again. <laughs> I smell three enemies. Don't get careless. 
It's weak to fire, but you the king of the Pringles. Here goes. That's some thick skin. Three enemies left. Go for it. You knocked him down. Good idea, Yuki chan. Yuki-chan's showing no mercy. Here goes. Crush your time. It's dead. Now's my turn. I live for this part. Yikes, reinforcements. We were nearly done. It's weak to ice. I think I have an ice persona, didn't I? Jack Frost, that would definitely be a... Ice. Two enemies left. Persona. And it was it blocked it. Oh shit. You know what? I'm just gonna punch this guy in the face. Atta boy, Yosuke, you're in the zone. Here goes Persona. Underestimate me. This is what you get. Smart bomb. Most of the stuff I'm never gonna use because I'm a hoarder. <laughs> Oh, these. Okay. Yeah, it's not going down. Three enemies. Let's get through this. One of these guys has a silence ability. Definitely not. Here goes. Crush your time. Lay down and die already. Oh, Yuki Chan, that was lovely. <laughs> Fire break. I'll have to try to get her leveled so I can check out that.
Persona, luck. I'm just gonna go. Whenever I see luck cards, I should just always get them. I feel like I could cheese my way through the entire game with, like, high luck. seem like a particularly great persona aside from its light ability. Enemies won't notice you, so change your force, take a skill card, take a three. I think that's the same one I got a bit ago. Alright. I think these guys are weak to wind. Electricity will work on it. Electricity. Finishing battle with all attack will always trigger shuffle time. Not sure this game. Oh, that's the same message from the ago. I saw movement out of the corner of my eye, but it was just an ad. survived it. Survive, I think. Nope. Oh. Three enemy reinforcements. Three enemies down. Generally speaking, you want to have all possible elements covered. The final party member is good at that, since she has access to every element and can make up for any gaps in the party depending on what you need her to do. Nice. Yeah, that's been that's something I've been wanting to try to get. 
like, um, Yosuke here has, uh, wind. I've been trying to memorize them all. I know that, uh... Yukiko has, uh, fire. And she has, like, some of the best heal abilities. So I'm definitely gonna be keeping her around. Oh, they're weak to win and light. How about that? Got the coal for the quest. I did? I didn't even notice that. Oh, yeah. Shit, shit, shit. Punch him in the face. Oh, okay, fuck Just you. One enemy left. <laughs> yeah, that time I beat it without them having a turn. I think that's another thing that triggers it. Enemies won't let us shoot until choosing force. No. Why would you pick that? Oh, that's right, you get two more picks. Ooh, you know what? I'm gonna get this, this, and this. Now I regret not having a different... I need to figure out, like, the best persona to use for, uh... Main character. I'm gonna finish up this floor and I'm gonna head out since I got what I came in for. I get... Oh. Snow Yow. I'm guessing this is probably, like, a... Ice Resist. Oh wait, it's an equipment. Let's take a look. Increases ice damage. Oh. I might... I might gear my, um main character towards an ice persona because that's something that I don't have as a part of the main group right now. What do I have that's a good one? Jack Frost, I assume. Maybe this is one that I should work on leveling to make a good one. Would you say Jack Frost is a good one? Obviously, this one needs some leveling before I could call it good, but... Fear, Panic, and Rage. Nullifies Ice Resist. Ice to all foes.
that's a better one you can get. There's a better one you can get later. It's worth using for now, though. Okay, noted. Oh, uh... Increases magic by one. How about instead of that... That seems like a pretty nice, uh... Little compliment for that. So you know what? Maybe I'll stay a little bit longer to get some leveling done on it. I smell three enemies. Don't get careless. Light will work on it. Here goes. Persona. That's it, Yosuke. Yeah. One enemy down. Yeah. Yosuke pounded an enemy. Oh. You know, just so I can get a chance to actually switch to my persona and get some XP on it. There we go. Agility increases. Element susceptibility. Shit. Alright, I need to take out the bogan. Clap her head with a couple of wrenches. That seems like a good way to make her not angry. Yosuke's on the warpath. Give him one for Keep me. Keep it going. That's my true strength. Bomb of life.
I don't imagine there's any other quest items I can get in here. Oh, someone wanted something that's found in a place with steam. That's right. I can't remember what that item was that I wanted for that. Four enemies. They weren't expecting us. That's a new one, I don't think. I've it's seen before. Four enemies. You gotta hang in there. Let's do this. Yuki-chan! Here goes! Push it on! <laughs> Serves him right! I'll spawn from specific shadows, and the shadows only show up on set floors. Ah. Uh. Ice boost. That actually looks interesting. Medium wind. Oh, this one can do wind and fire. Huh. I mean, either way, I can't really take it, because, uh... Full. I, I I really need to figure out the uh, level for me. that blue door in the town. I need to figure that out. I'm just always too busy to read up on this stuff. Protagonist. A lot of personas can use more than one skill. Most of the rest of the party only ever focuses on one element. No, no. Well, what enemy ambushed you? Hang in there. You can win this. Do your best. Chat bonuses. Silences. level increases.
Actually, I probably should have just grabbed the uh, level up because I'm going to be leaving. Increase. Rank 2 cup card. Alright, I'm assuming that'll boost ice type attacks. Firecracker. By 10%, that's not bad. On top of the 20% I get from my charm, that's a pretty decent boost. Uh, I think I'm good here now. Oh, hang on. I can never remember what the shit's called. Go home, Rome, right? Yeah. Oh, reading it out loud. Go, ho go home. I, I get it now. boost is 25%. Ice Amp is another skill it stacks with that increase it by another 50. Oh, wow. I bet you can do stupid damage with that combo then. Uh, especially with my charm. I'll have to work on getting all that then. That actually sounds like it'd be really good. Three of you are sitting at the table. Entertainment news show is on. That concludes Risei Kujikawa's statement regarding her temporary leave of absence from the entertainment industry. We're short on time, so if anyone has any remaining questions, we ask that you please keep them brief. I'm Ishioka from Ladies View. It says here that you'll be recuperating. Are you facing physical problems? No, my health isn't an issue. Oh, hey, her. Psychological problems, then? What? Rumor has it you'll be staying with your relatives, but isn't that in Inaba where the murders have been taking place? Huh? Um... Is it true that they run a traditional tofu shop? Will you be helping out with the family business? No more questions. This press conference is over. Clear the way, please. Is Risei-chan quitting her job on TV? Who knows? But if this is her hometown, we'll have to deal with everyone who's trying to get a glimpse. Risei. Whenever I saw her name, I thought it was just like I thought her name was Rise. Rise up, gamers. I'm tired of diets. Enough with going to the gym. Good thing there's something even I can handle. <laughs> calorie magic is made for those worried about their calorie intake and body fat. It'll slim you down in no time. Risei Kujikawa, huh? The one good thing about this town was that it had nothing of note. Now we get all the buzz. What's going on? Yo. Sorry, I haven't completely woken up yet. Oh yeah, the shopping district seemed different today when I was passing by. Everyone was really hustling more than usual. What's going on? Smell. Man, you're sounding like Teddy. Didn't seem like the cops were involved in what was there, though. Guess I'll try asking around at school. I like to think that they're not actually talking. They're just kind of waving their hands around awkwardly. Hey, there he is. 
You've been coming to school pretty often lately. What's up? It's this annoying thing called Four. the mandatory attendance policy. Okay, good to know. I'll have to do that immediately. Man, seeing you here kind of reminds me of the school camp out. I thought we were all gonna forget about what happened. Oh, sorry. <sighs> eh, whatever. So hey, you guys see the news? News? Oh, that stuff about Risei Kujikawa taking a break from showbiz? I wonder why. She was just getting popular lately. Just goes to prove that being an idol is tough work. Huh? You don't know her? Dude, what's wrong with you? She's all over the media. It hasn't been that long since her debut, but at this rate, she'll be a top-class idol in no time. To be honest, I'm a fan too. She's such a cutie pie. A cutie pie? What are you, 80? <laughs> But I think she used to live here, so she must have a lot of local fans. The news said she's going to her grandmother's tofu shop, right? Do they mean Maruku? Maruku? Maruku tofu. Our inn was serving their tofu until recently. Oh, that place in the shopping district. I pass by it all the time. Wait, does that mean I can meet Rise if I go to her tofu shop? Hey, aren't we getting a little sidetracked from the point here? <laughs> Did you forget about the murders? You're the one who said the connection between the victims might be the TV. She could be the next target. Come on, it's not like Risa started showing up on TV just recently. Also, how could Risa be connected to the incident so far? I wondered the same thing, so I did some research. It seems that she had no personal interaction with Miss Yamano. They've just been on the same show once or twice. She's been an idol for a while now, but she's the talk of the town thanks to the news last night. And she is moving here after all. So if our assumptions are correct, she fits the pattern. She'll probably be targeted next. And if she is, that narrows down the killer's methods even further. What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> Kanji-kun, listen real carefully. If Rise is next, then that lets us rule out our theory that the targets have to be connected with the first case. And that means the killer's targets are people who have been shown on TV recently. Get it now? Huh. All right. Now, we have to keep a close eye on everything Rise does. Let's do it! Sheesh, he's all pumped up. I'm sorry, I just got distracted by how square her mouth looks. <laughs> Alright, that's the end of the proof and the end of the chapter two. So I've heard all the gossip going around about Rize. Uh, these idols don't have normal people problems. They'll have money, they'll have to come. Uh, they'll have money. They'll never have to compromise in marriage. Uh, what shall I make for dinner tonight? But, you know, June is bonus month. That's why I'm a little bit happier right now. They say that Japan first implemented the bonus during the Maiji era. What a wonderful culture. Hey, you listen to me? I'm talking about a wonderful culture. Especially you, Luz Kuhn. You're looking bored. What period did Japan first implement bonus pay? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't speak Baka. Uh, uh, anybody know? I might just guess. Meji. Okay. Ah, uh, she, she said it. Okay, I wasn't paying attention. I, enough attention, I guess. <laughs> Again, issuing bonuses during the Meiji period. 
I, I always have a hard time knowing what part to pay it, like, what part to remember in this. <laughs> I know you're always supposed to remember something, they say, but... It's a wonderful culture, it's the joy and labor. So you're all ignoring me, thinking I'm just chit-chatting, eh? This is gonna be on the test. You get the correct answer. Oh, it just increased. Sure, but other times supposed to just know or look it up online. Classes have ended for the day. Choice to wait another rainy night. Just in case, I should do a save. Okay, now I need to check that upstairs thing you were talking about. Find a magician. It's on this floor? Okay. I only get the chance to see Senpai since we've switched to summer uniforms. I don't think anyone in the whole world could look more amazing in white. think she has a notification above her or anything. Wow, and they expected you to just know to do it, huh? If you heard, he said he's coming to Inaba. I can't believe it. I mean, it's reset. Uh, Inaba doesn't really seem to like her kind of town, but... really seem like her kind of town, but wow, so exciting. Uh... Timing. You use some assistance. Uh, I'm guessing that would take time. That's a boy, I think. Damn anime. It is another fat. Oh, it is? Okay. There's some materials to build a new dowsing rod. Suspicious pole. I got a suspicious pole for ya. It's not raining. Oh, and it's Monday. Well, that's a pity. What is my level with you? Five. Sports practice today since you haven't done that in forever. Get out of this. Sports practice. Was that the, uh, the open door at the end of the hall on this floor. Okay. I don't explore enough, I feel. I always worry about wasting time going to, like, nothing. The note on the door reads, practices are on Tuesday, Thursday, and... Well, shit. I'd never even bet on this end. 
relationship with Anya will become closer. A Aeon. Symphonic band. Cut, cut, cut. The trombone is flat. Is that you again, Ion? I'm so sorry. All right, let's see what we can do about the tempo in that second movement. I'd make a um, I'd make a whiplash joke here, but I don't want. I, I worry about Twitch detecting certain words. <laughs> You played your trumpet with passion. The expression has increased. Senpai. <laughs> I know you said you didn't have much experience, but you sounded beautiful today. Sorry, I don't know that means. Uh, I know that doesn't mean much coming from someone like me. <sighs> I was sticking out again today. I wish I had as much talent as you. Oh, I'm really thinking of being an asshole. <laughs> I don't have it in me. <laughs> Not enough understand- well, you know what? You're right, I shouldn't delete myself. <laughs> Your courage is encouraging. <laughs> <laughs> Stunning and rave. <laughs> we have another trombone player here. It's really good, so he gets picked for the performances. So I've never gone for one, but it doesn't matter. I can't play in front of an audience anyway. Sorry, I shouldn't bother you with all this. I'm gonna get this place picked up so I can go home. <laughs> what? Oh my, it's already getting a guard. Why was that? Thank you very much. The no <laughs> I was nothing but a fucking asshole. <laughs> and then I get a relationship rank up. <laughs> Fuck her own. <laughs> I'm so diligent. <laughs> You're back. I don't even help with the cleanup and just sit and watch. I'm so diligent. my theories here. The people who are going missing are all appearing on TV. Who's watching TV all the fucking time? Somehow, she might be the killer and might not even know it. That's my theory. A game theory. <clears throat> Turn forward. Ship with us. It's time. Ah. Night. So 
zombie. Lick it. What the hell? You really regret doing that. Your courage has greatly increased. However, you don't feel very well. You decided to go to bed early today. Damn it. That reminds me, I have that uh, courage book. And it's raining. Let's watch the Midnight Channel tonight. Oof. My one chance to do the thing. And it's raining. the guy who wants the uh, demon statue. Transfer to copy. Copy? Must have made a mistake. This is your shoebox. Channel student ran away. There's something in your shoebox. It's a note. Why did this add to the blue? held my emotion back all this time because I didn't want to disrupt your studies, but I just had to tell you. It's a very moving love note. However, it's actually addressed to someone else. Apparently the girl put this in the wrong shoebox. Perhaps she's the one who wrote to... Oh! You should talk to her the next time you see her. If you read or study while it's raining, you will get a bigger stat boost. Okay. Not you. Always feels like she's trying to flirt with me. It kind of weirds me out. <laughs> uh, it's you again. You're looking for a payback? Oh, this guy, that's right. See if your mind can find this. Riddle time. And you gotta drop the last item in the proper category. Can you dig it? Red's group A. Gray's group B. White's putting it down for group A. Orange has a group B button. A's for sheezy. Pink is... This doesn't make sense to me. So which group does black belong to? A or B? Holla. What? Ah, oh, this guy's... Group A, then top six flag colors. Okay. These items have common. Give it to me. Wait. I feel like we... Your mind is a beautiful thing. You're not letting it go to waste. You know, way to be. Oh, that's right. I, I could have swore we picked flags last time, but I remember now it was cars. Yeah. Since you're down the... You know that a group A is for the six, blah, blah, blah. The other two to round out the top six are blue and yellow. I must say, I wasn't expecting a second year to have such treachery insight. You passed, and now I dub you my riddle brother. Here's this little something something. Three chess keys, nice. Quest one. Nothing over here. about you holy shit it's the delete guy from death note did you know there used to be cleaning club at the school I'm the last surviving member of that club I mean everyone else was graduated already I will this year even though the club will be gone I'm looking for someone to continue my passion you seem promising would you be interested in succeeding me that's so I'd like you to get the equipment that shows you are indeed worthy of taking on the passion of cleanliness. Don't worry, it's nothing difficult. I want you to bring a tool and clothing that is fitting for cleaning. So it should be something fit for cleaning a floor. Workshop in a practice building. 
Well, you really doesn't have to be anything special. Just remember that they'll get dirty while you're working, right? Maybe you can find what you need at a clothing store. Okay, uh, oh, I should go to the meat thing. The meatball. That's not the meatball. I went the one before this, I believe. No, that's the bookstore. Shop here in rainy days. Okay, she sells like consumables. Check the job board while you're here too. Oh right, yeah. Uh, if I can remember where that is. I'll, I'll, I'll probably not when I see it. Oh, right here. There's a several job openings, which we want to read. Any in particular that are a good one to pick? So there's hospital janitor. Daycare caretaker. Yeah, I was thinking that sounds like it might be decent money. Oh, it actually gives detail. Diligence required. I actually have a lot of diligence, too. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday nights. Gives you a shot of courage. Ooh. Diligence is sufficient. You've taken a hospital janitor job. From the bus stop and the shopping district on Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. Okay, it's meat time. Still can't see the rice. Understanding, knowledge, diligence. on the TV that's supposed to rain tonight. figure appeared. Seems to be a girl. She's wearing a swimsuit. She looks somewhat like Rize, the idol you saw on TV yesterday. For some reason it keeps zooming in on her chest and thighs. It's hard to make out her face as a result. Thoughts 
so. Oh, I guess I shouldn't be so excited. There's a chance she might get kidnapped. Come on, we should go there tomorrow. Uh, what was it called again? Uh, oh yeah, Maruku Tofu. Dude, my heart's pounding already. We'll see you tomorrow. Do we come to Marukyo Tofu Shop with Yosuke tomorrow? I decided to go to bed for the night. Hey, did you hear? It looks like Risei Kujikawa really is here. You know the tofu store, Marukyo? The owners of that place have the same last name, Kujikawa. Seriously? Hey, I practically live next door. I've been hearing that there's a big crowd at Maraku. I'm not surprised. But was it really her on yesterday's Midnight Channel? Didn't she seem a little... different? It was her, no doubt about it. Her curves, her posture, even her beautiful slim legs. What's that look for? Anyways, I'm positive, right? <laughs> uh, are we going? I don't really care about celebrities, but it's not like I got anything better to do. Sure, I'll tag along. Sorry, but me and Yukiko have plans. Give us a call if anything comes up. Well, shall we get going? But let's be clear on one thing. We're not spectators. We're on an investigation, got it? Said to go to the Mark Yoko tofu shop. Huh? Uh, Mr. Detective, did something happen? Oh, it's you guys. Ay, ay, ay. These gawkers keep streaming in with their cars, trying to park in the middle of the shopping district. Why is that? Don't you know? Risei Kujikawa's here. Hey, did you see her already? Is she there? Which is it? Huh? We're asking why a plainclothes detective is here doing traffic control. Oh, uh, well, the Inaba Police Department isn't that big. We don't have enough staff. Well, I still have work to do, so I'll see you later. Dude, you managed to scare off a police detective on active duty! I wasn't trying to scare the guy. I just said what I was thinking. But you're right. It's weird for the police to come out like this. Hey, you think the police suspect that Risa might be the next target too? All right, clear out. Coming through. Hey, Adachi! Damn it, I told him not to leave his post. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Hmm? Kanji Tatsumi. Are you friends with them? Like it's any of your business. If you say so. So I'll ask again. What are you all doing here? Hmm. Oh, um... Well, who wouldn't want to come check it out if they found out an idol's family ran an ordinary tofu store? I'm a, a big fan. Hmm. Fine. But remember, she might be a celebrity, but this is her home. Try not to bother them too much. That cop's your uncle, huh? So, what the hell was that about? Are you guys under suspicion? Well, they did take us in once. We can't just tell him everything, right? If we say anything about the other world, we only look more suspicious. They'll be watching us all the time. You got a point there. Ah, uh, man. There's no one in there but the old lady. Rosetta isn't here after all. I heard that she really is already here, but it might have just been a rumor. Well, it was fun while it lasted. She's not here! 
here? Seriously? <laughs> you sound like the world's about to end. Shut up! Anyways, now that all those people are gone, we might as well check inside. I'll buy something. Hmm. How'd you know I can't eat tofu? Wow, that's considerate of you. Well, that was lucky. I don't Wait, like tofu what's either. What's <laughs> modoki again? Is it the kind with a rice cake in it? There's no rice cakes in them. They're sort of like fried tofu patties with veggies and stuff mixed in and... Yusuke received a crash course on Gamodoki. Oh, okay. I know what you mean. I think I can eat that. Let's see here. Sure enough, the only one here is your typical old lady. Man, why don't you just ask if she's in back? Excuse me. Uh, yes, may I help you? What the... Then, who's that? What? <sighs> uh, are you Rise? Yeah, so? No way! Are you really Reset? What do you want? Huh? Oh, sorry, um, uh, some tofu, please? Tofu? Which kind? Huh? Which one's which again? If you're going to eat it by itself, you should go with silken. Moment's better for cooking. Depends how you use it. Uh... Kanji, order something! <laughs> Why are you making me do it? You already picked Ganmo a second ago. Dude here wants three Ganmonoki. Oh, I see. I'll go get them. She's nothing like she seems on TV. I wonder if she's just tired. Man, but it's really her. I'm so glad I came. Mission complete. Wait, we haven't done what we came here for yet. Um, ha, uh, have you noticed anything weird lately? Weird? Like stalkers? Are you guys fans of mine? I wouldn't say we, but yeah. Dude here is a big fan. You little... Why'd you let that slip? <laughs> her curves, her posture, even her beautiful slim legs. You finished checking them out yet or what? <laughs> oh, uh, you're doing this on purpose, aren't you? I didn't say that. I never said any of that. <laughs> Maybe you know already, but it's been dangerous in Inaba lately. And that's why we've been investigating some stuff. Oh, yeah? Sorry, um... Uh, let's see. Do you know about the TV show that comes on at midnight? I mean, it's not like regularly scheduled programming. Uh, how do I explain this? That thing that was on last night. The Midnight Channel, yeah? Oh, you know about it. Wait, what? You, you mean you saw it last night? I heard the rumors from some friends of mine. But that girl last night wasn't me. I've never been filmed wearing that swimsuit before. And the bust line. Huh? Mine aren't that big. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean now. <laughs> I mean, what am I saying? Um, I'm sorry. Don't apologize so much. You're funny. Hey, she smiled. What is that show about, anyway? Well, we're not too sure either. But you know there's been stuff happening here, right? We think the people who appear there are the ones who get kidnapped next. I know this is sudden, but we're not lying. Yeah, that's why we thought you should know about it. Huh, so that wasn't a dream. I was tired yesterday, but I couldn't sleep. And it was raining, so I decided to try that rumor I'd heard about. Hmm. All right, thanks. I'll be careful. Here you go, three ganmo. That'll be 600 yen. There's extra tofu in there for everyone. A little thank you for worrying about me. Whoa, seriously? Thanks! 
Yosuke Senpai, you can't eat tofu, right? Want me to take yours? Hell no, I always eat what people give me. Because he gives you a block of tofu. Maybe you can eat it for dinner. Later that day. Thank you very much. Your receipt's in the bag. Seems like the crowds are thinning out, so we'll be leaving now. If it gets rowdy again, just give us a call at the station. Okay. Uh, hang on a second. I'm sorry, but there's some things I'd like to ask you. You do know that there have been multiple violent cases around here lately, yeah? Have you seen anyone suspicious around? Not really. It's been like always. Like always? Well, you're an idol. So I imagine you deal with folks like fans, paparazzi, and stalkers quite often. What made you take a break from showbiz? Does it really matter? I just needed a rest. And have you registered for school? I'm planning on going to Yasugami High. It was the closest. Well, I don't mean to alarm you, but... You do have some things in common with the recent victims. That's why... I might be kidnapped, oh. right? I've been told that before. Don't worry, I'll be careful. Huh? Someone told you already? It was three guys. They were wearing uniforms, so I think they were high school students. Did one of them happen to look... How do I put it? Did he look something like a, a gang member? Wait! You think she's talking about your nephew and his friends? Hmm. Something smells here. The recent disappearances between those and the two homicides is too many questions with no answers. To tell the truth, I followed my detective's intuition and came here to warn her. How could high school kids who know less than we do beat us to the punch? Were they just making up an excuse to talk to a famous celebrity? Or... Sir? Yasugami Hai. The second victim, Saki Konishi. And two other students who were missing for a while. I guess the investigation of the ones involved with the school hasn't turned up anything either. Aren't we going to be in trouble if this keeps up? The prefectural police will be coming soon. They're the least of your worries. Keep your head in the game. We sure have a lot of tofu. Yeah, it tastes great. You visited Risei Kujikawa today. What did you talk about? To be honest. I told you to keep your hands off this. Listen, this is a job for the police. <sighs> Forget it. I shouldn't have brought it up. You guys met Risei Chan? <sighs> yeah. Are you fighting again? Of course not. Here, hurry and finish your dinner. The tense atmosphere continues into the night. figure appeared. It's the same girl as before, still wearing a swimsuit. Jocerian's waist are emphasized. This girl. It's Rize. The image is fully, fairly clear tonight. <clears throat> Should you try calling Yosuke? Yeah. Hey, we were right about it being Rize Kujikawa. 
Oh, the one on tonight seemed a lot creepier than the real Rise, but you could see her face clearly. There's no mistake. Let's all get together as soon as possible tomorrow. I have to go to bed for the night. I've had zero opportunity to make that social link with Kanji. That's a pity. So about the midnight channel last night, that had to be Risei Kujikawa. It even showed her face this time. So now we know one more thing. The ones that the culprit's targeting are... Exactly. So we can rule out the assumption that all the victims are connected to the incident with Ms. Yamano. As for Rise, I took a peek this morning and she was still at the shop. So I'm guessing that TV show thing doesn't appear on the midnight channel until after the person enters the TV. Teddy said before that it might be the victim's own creation upon entering that world. I didn't understand at all at first, but now I feel it may be true. The one that appears on TV is your other self. Maybe the victim's true feelings are shown unconsciously. But we see them on the midnight channel before they disappear. You know, when it's still really fuzzy and you can't tell who it is. How do you explain that part? Yeah, it always happens before the person disappears. Like an advance notice. Or like a ransom note. But who are they announcing it to and for what? I don't know, ask the killer. There's a bunch of stuff I still don't understand. Is it possible that we see those images for the same reason? Huh? What do you mean? If the Midnight Channel shows the victim's true feelings, maybe it does the same for the culprit. Maybe what we're seeing is the culprit's intentions. Well, it's a possibility. The killer can throw people into the TV after all. Which means they must have the same power that we do. So, when the killer thinks, I'm gonna attack someone now, that's what we see on TV? I don't know about that. Well, if we're gonna go that far with it, we might as well say that's the basis for that entire world. Like it's some kind of mix of the minds of the victims and the killer. Or maybe it's everyone's minds. Always, nothing makes sense. Hey, Kanji kun, you still with us? You haven't said a word yet. Uh, 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 you weren't sleeping, were you? Uh, of course not. I was uh, <clears throat> lost in thought. I wish I knew what that world's all about. Teddy's explanations have so many maybes in them that I don't understand the first thing about it. Why would the culprit throw people inside the TV in the first place? They must know by now that people die when they're in there long enough. There's no doubt it's attempted murder. So the TV's a good way to do that because the police can never prove anything about the crime. Murder, huh? So the killer's got a grudge against certain people? Well, I know there's a shitload of people who've got my number. How about you, Yukiko-senpai? Anyone hate you so bad they'd get rid of you forever? No. Uh, Yukiko? There's always a slight chance, and you just don't realize it. <laughs> but if we're trying to think of a common grudge someone would have against all the victims, oh, I'm drawing a blank. Well, the good thing is, we have another shot at getting ahead of the killer. We can leave the motive aside for now. Once we catch him, we'll make him talk. The only thing we can be sure of now is that Rise is in danger. Wait, we get to do another stakeout? Hell yeah! This time we'll catch him in the act! We gotta go with donuts and milk. You said it. 
There's no better meal than that for a man on a stakeout. Oh, and throw in some disposable diapers. For what? They don't even sell those here. We have them at Juness. Oh, too much information. You guys finished yet? Let's hurry up and get going. What brings you here? Oh, uh, well, I'm doing legwork. Uh, what did I do to deserve babysitting detail? I mean, it's nothing major. It's not like Dojima-san ordered me here. So, what are you kids up to? Buying snacks? We were just about to head over to the tofu shop to see Rise-chan. Oh, I see. Hey, I'm on my way there, too. Oh, then why don't we go there together? Come on, he's a detective on active duty. <laughs> Not a bad guy to have around. Rizé is tending the shop. Don't stop, the culprit might get suspicious. Well, we walked past her like a thousand times already. Come on out, you bastard. We're ready for you. <laughs> Look! Uh, who's there? Here. Probably just a distraction. Stop running, damn it. Don't, don't come near me. Yeah, there's no way this is the big bad guy. Yeah, it's just some dickhead who's trying to take a picture. Shut up. What kind of idiot would listen to I'll do it, you know. What are you gonna do if I get run over? <laughs> what? No! If the suspect gets injured, the police will be held responsible. They'll get really angry and... Uh... I'll do it, I swear! S -s -s get out of here and stop chasing me! Hey, what should we do? <laughs> Barney wants to... <laughs> Part of me really wants to just tackle his ass. <laughs> yeah, that's the quickest way. All right, on my mark. Look, over there, a Martian! Oh, okay. Oh! I thought I was gonna <laughs> push him into the car. How dare you assault an ordinary citizen like... Shut the hell up, murderer. We're taking your punk ass in. What? Time out! What do you mean, murderer? It's no use playing dumb. W wait a second. I just really like Rosette, so I wanted to take a peek in her room. Look, see? All I've got on me is a bunch of cameras. <laughs> yep, you're the culprit, all right. No two ways about it. All right, I'll take it from here. We'll hear your story down at the station. <laughs> I've waited to use that line. <laughs> Please, let me go. I didn't do anything wrong. I know for a fact it's not a crime in this country to take secret pictures. Hey, don't you understand what's happening here? You're under suspicion of murder. Come with me. We'll talk about this later. Wow, that went better than I thought. What a coup. I gotta thank you guys for all your help. Well done. Oh, sure. But you really should stop getting involved with this stuff. It's dangerous. I know Dojima-san was worried sick. Come on, let's... Oh, oops. 
Is it really over? The rest is up to the cops. Looks like the killer was a pervert, just like we thought. Wait, does that mean the case is closed? Seriously? Awesome! Hey, we should let Reset know the good news. Oh, hello. Would you like some tofu? Oh, uh, hello. Um... Oh, did you come to see Rise? She seems to have gone out, unfortunately. Huh? But wasn't she just here? She does that sometimes. She'll just wander out without a word. You must forgive her. She's quite worn out in many ways. This sounds like the voice actress that did, um... Old Lady Toph and Cora. She left without saying anything? Come on, you worry too much. She must have just stepped out. I mean, we caught the guy. Wha what are you talking about? We'll discuss it later. If you'll excuse me, I've got to take this guy in for questioning. Man, I can't wait to see the look on Dojima-san's face. She left without saying anything? Could that mean... Well, shouldn't we look for her? She can't have gone far. Yeah, I agree. I can't find her anywhere. What about you guys? None of the neighbors have seen her. Hmm. Maybe we're just not looking in the right places. But where could she have gone? Damn it, this can't be good. I hope I'm wrong. Well, we did everything we can. No use griping about it. The weatherman says it's gonna rain tonight. So let's just keep our fingers crossed and tune in. Delivery for you left on the table. Power belt. Prize sticker. Okay. Power belt sounds like something that would benefit kanji. Strength by two. Yeah, that's a kanji thing. Wait, what was this headman against? Strength by one. So, yeah, I got an extra strength bonus. Nice. God, am I really been streaming for three hours? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here. Looks like next time I've got a dungeon to do. Two and a half. Yeah, I think that's long enough. I'll try to do another one soon. Getting into that dungeon. Alright, see ya.